Alina Rabakina versus Maria Sakkari. First quarter final for the ladies Miami Open for 2024. And both have had different roads to get to this stage. Sakkari entered the tournament as the number eight seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on Yuan, who had been in very good form lately, which is no problem getting through in straights. 6-2, 6-2. In the third round, she take on Yastremska, the 28th seed. And after a close first set, Sakkari would get through in straights. 7-5, 6-4. In the fourth round, she was supposed to play Kalinskaya, the 22nd seed, who had just demolished Ostapenko in the previous round. But unfortunately... Kalen Sky had a leg problem and had to pull out, handing Sakri the walkover. Rebecca entered the tournament as a number four seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on the qualifier Towson, and after dropping the first set, would have to fight back to win three six seven five six four. In the third round, she take on the qualifier Townsend, who had just beaten Mertens in the previous round, and after dropping the second set, would have to fight to win again in three six three six seven six four. Fourth round, she take on the 17th seed Keys, who was coming back from injury, and after a close second set. Rebecca would get through in straights, 6-3-7-5, to advance to the quarterfinal. These two have only played three times before, with Rebecca leading the head-to-head 2-1, but they did play a really fun match last year at the WTA Finals, with Rebecca eventually getting through in a tiebreaker in the third set. So if it's anything like that match in Cancun last year, we're in for a fire matchup. If Zachary's going to win this one, she needs to keep the aggression and use that confidence that she got last week in Indian Wells. She's been in such good form the last couple of weeks. Of course, having the new coach has really, really helped. So it'll be really interesting to see the tactics and seeing how that Zachary plays against Rabakina with this new coach and also if she can keep that aggression. Rabakina's going to win this one. She needs to serve well. She's been serving okay this week, but of course, she has lost a couple of sets as well against qualifiers, which is very unusual. Maybe a little bit of rust from not playing for over a month, but she needs to serve well in this one against Zachary and she also needs to bully Zachary push her around, she's going to get the win. Such a fun matchup, and like I said, if we got anything like the WTA Finals last year, it's going to be absolute fire, but I have to go with Rabakina in three. I think Rabakina might just get through Sakri. Sakri's had a great run. Of course, lost to Sviantek in the final of Indian Wells, but if Rabakina plays well, I think she just gets the win in a very close match, but let me know down in the comments below who's going to make the semifinals.